friends this is Sunil Jadav and you welcome back to my channel in this video we will see how to find out HCF that is highest common factor with the Euclid's algorithm or in other words we can say GCD what is GCD greatest common multiple or highest common factor how to find out with the help of Euclid's algorithm let's see Let's see, use Euclid's division algorithm to find out HCF of 135 and 225. You know that how to find it out with the Euclid's division algorithm. We know that Euclid's division algorithm says that A is equal to BQ plus R. That is A is a dividend. Dividend is equal to divisor into quotient plus remainder with the condition that 0 is less or equal to remainder will be less than b that is less than dividend not dividend but it is divisor now let us see how to find out it's by the simple method then we know how to find it out 135 is equal to we know the factors of 135 that is 3 into 3 into 3 into 5 5 3 is a 15 3 is a 45 3 is a 135 and another is 2 to 5 that is equal to the we should the, write the factors that is 3 into 3 into 5 into 5. 5 5 is a 25, 3 is a 75, 75, 3 is a 2 to 5. Now we know how to find out HCF. HCF of both of them will be equal to we need to take highest common factor that means 3, 3, 2 times that means in both this comes so I will write it 3 again 3, 3 comes once that is 3 here 3 but no 3 more so I will not write it more. 5, 5, once it is repeated, 5, here it is 5, but no more 5 is there. So, 5, 3 is a 15, 3 is a 45. So, HCF will be equal to 45. This is simple method to find out HCF. Now, we will go to find out the same thing by the Euclid's division algorithm. Let us see. For doing that, first of all, the first step is that we need to see which one of them is greater. Then we know that is 2 to 5 is greater than 135 before doing this will i will show you that write it simply and then we'll keep it in this particular format so 2 to 5 i will try to divide by 135 then here we should see 135 2 za will be greater than that and it is 1 za 135 we should take the difference it is 0 13 22 means we'll get 90 now, this 135 I will divide it by this remainder 90. So, I will write it 135. I will try to divide by 90. Again, 90 to the 180. So, 91 is 90. The difference will be 45. Here, 45. I will try to divide this 90 by 45. Then you should see 45 to the 90. And the remainder will be 0, 0. So, here I will write it in this particular format that is 135 is a divisor, 2 to 5 is a dividend, 1 is quotient and this 90 is remainder. So, I will write it here that is 2 to 5 should be write it like dividend, sorry that 2 to 5 is itself a dividend, 135 is a divisor, so B that is we know that B A would be divided by B. We got Q and remainder R. So this is what 2 to 5 is equal to B. B means 1, 3, 5 into this one that is quotient 1 plus remainder. What is remainder? 90. 135 into 1, 135 plus 90 is equal to 2 to 5. Second step as it is 135 that is dividend has to divide by 90. So, this time 90 will be divisor. So, 90 into what is quotient that is 1 plus in this case what is remainder 45. So, this is second number step. Now, again 90 is a dividend. So, 90 is equal to 45 into the quotient is 2 plus remainder is 0, 0. Now here in this case you can see that when the remainder becomes 0, the value of R becomes 0, at the same time we got this 
dividend or we can say the value of B would be equal to 45. So this will be the HCF of both of them. So I should write it that HCF of 225 and 135 will be equal to 45. Here we check by the simple method also we got the same answer and this is by the Euclid's division algorithm we got that HCF is 45.